What's going on guys, my name's Ian and welcome back to Pokemon Glaze version. Last episode we got ourselves our 8th gym badge and we evolved Dragonair into Dragonite who's looking awesome. I don't know if she's fainted for some reason, I can't remember why. But yeah, run the um, run the badge path thingy my bob. We're going to get all our badges inspected before we enter Victory Road. Hopefully we can finish Victory Road today, that's the plan. Um, but we need to pass all the badge checks first. We've only passed one so far and it looks like there's trainer battles all, all the way along. Um, this dude's a psychic. Let's go with Earthquake. But yeah, so we are we're getting to the nitty gritty of it all. But once again, guys, I'm not going to do the post game, but we are going to go all the way up to the champion of Elite Four, which is, of course, Blake. Um, I'm very excited. I can't wait, honestly, to, uh, to check out Victory Road in this game. Um, so we're about to reach our second badge, uh, badge check. And this is an interesting badge check, though. I've never seen this type of thing done before, so that's kind of cool to see. Um... Actually, Lucario, let's just change into let's change the cheeks and use an earthquake, why not? But yeah, so I'm hoping we can do Victory Road today and get ourselves to Elite Four. And then after that we can hopefully just go ahead and own the Elite Four in two episodes and then the champion in one. So there we go. Oh we got a oh no, I thought we were getting a phone call. Press badge detected, awesome. Um let's see, we got another badge detected. Stem badge detected. Oh we're about to enter the forest now. Um, apparently, there's dark types in here, so this is interesting. Can you feel the presence of evil in this forest? Sure, why not? Um, let's go for a Dragon Claw. Hey, I almost uh, took him out. Let's go for an Extreme Speed, which will take him out. There we go. Um, Shedinger. I always forget what affects these guys. It has to be super effective, doesn't it? So, we need Fire. Or... Will Extreme Speed work? No. I'm trying to think what affects it. I think Ice will, I think. So let me see. I, I always suck with these things, so I never like go up against them. But I think Ice and Fire affects them. But we'll see. Okay, hurt self confusion again. Come on. Nope, didn't work. Okay, let me think. I know I suck right now, guys, but let's use Wing Attack. There we go. I knew something affected it. <laughs> I think it has to be super effective, so I'm wondering why Ice didn't work, but hey-ho. Not sure. Yeah, Shed is always a pain in the butt. There's an Umbreon in here. That's pretty cool, actually. Another Umbreon in here. Wow, that's pretty cool, actually. Okay, let me switch into Notch. Let's see here. Switch into Notch. I'm not afraid of evil. Well, that's good to know, buddy. Good to know. Let me go ahead and use Aerial Ace on you. Wow, oh, that is a lot. Choose quick attack. There we go. I'll choose Gerda. I'm just gonna go for a fly because the aerialist didn't seem, didn't seem to work. And so there we go. And then one more fly on this conqueror should take it out. Let's see how that one works. Ah, good stuff. There we go. Is that the end of the forest now? I think I saw an exit up here. Here's a hunchcrow. Murkrow, sorry. A balls into a hunchcrow, my bad. Um another one. Man, this is like the hardest badge check I've ever been through, actually. This is crazy. Let's try it. Aerial Ace again. There we go. A Dridigan. Let's bring in Gift. This guy's clearly a dragon lover, so I'm going to go ahead and Ice Beam. Oh, but yeah, this is a pretty crazy badge check. I've never had a badge check where you have to go against people. So um, it's interesting to see, for sure. But uh, I think we have to be near the end of the forest by now. Surely. Some pretty cool Pokemon here. So far we've seen um, Umbreon and Murkrow, so they're pretty cool. And Absol as well. It's uh, quite neat. I wish I planned a picnic somewhere else. Uh, probably not the best place for it, buddy. Let's use Fly. I think we missed that Sleep Powder. That would have sucked. Skeptile, so you've got all the fully evolved. So your next one is going to be... Let me think. Uh, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me. It's going to be a... Torterra. It's going to be a Torterra. Just watch. Uh, superior. I was close, guys. I was close. And Notch just completely owned your faces. Right. Come on, we've got to be near the end now. Surely. Do we need to use Cut here, or...? I think we do. Let's use Cut. Get through here. Wow, a Houndoom. That is pretty sweet. There's some really quite cool Pokemon in this, in this place. Use the Smoke Ball. That wasn't really worth it. But we found the Houndoom, which was kind of cool. Okay, I don't know why I ran all the way down. 
Right, so are we near the exit now? Hopefully, please be near the exit. Zoro were uh, some really pretty cool Pokemon. Um, obviously they're all dark type, but yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Oh, I'm not scared, I'll go in right into the heart of the forest. Good for you. Man, Notch is being an absolute beast in this place. This one's gonna need a fly though. There we go. But yeah, Notch is, a, Notch is really carrying us through this forest right now. Good to see. And we're through, finally, that was crazy. And another battle. <laughs> Oh, this is absurd. Four times effective air release will take care of you. And um, Polyrath. I'm gonna go ahead and use Fly. There we go. Level 55. Now look at Notch go. Heracross. And four times effective air release will finish you. Good stuff. Now, that's another badge check done. High school badge detected. Radio. So we need Surf up here. Um. Let me go ahead and use Fly. Yep, yeah, nice crit there. Noctowl, we're gonna go ahead and bring in Notch here. Looks like the this one lacks flying types. Um, there we go. Swallow. Go ahead and use Ice Beam. Just keep using Ice Beam, I get. Oh, Sand Goose. Um, let's bring in Cheeks. And we'll go with a Rock Smash. There we go. And Samantha got defeated. Pelipper, not in the mood, buddy. Bring in Twist here, take on this this one. Um, man, it's gonna take an entire episode just to get through all these badge checks. It's crazy. Leaf Blade again. Oh, come on, Ted's cruel. Come on, give me a critical hit, here, Twist. Give me a crit. Feebas. We won't need a critical hit for this one. Uh, that also means it's going to have a Milo tick, isn't she? Yeah, Milo tick. There we go. Oh, no. Oh, come on. Cut me some slack. There we go. And uh, not twist level uh, 51. Didn't learn any tech, though. Might just try and skip the rest of these guys. It's just so long. Um, let's go rock climb. And rock climb again. There we go. Blaze badge detected. So one more badge. Oh wait, no, is that the final badge? I think it was the final badge. No, the final badge is the pound badge, I think. But that's Michael. Richard Road ahead. Liam, I'm sorry for what I may have put you through while I was in my power-seeking mood. I put away that kind of life. An associate of mine wants me to give this to you. Hey, we got the CEO key pass, nice. He wished for you to meet him on the top floor of Fusion Cove. That's in Palmetto Resort, if you don't remember. I hate to ask this of you, but I feel it may be important to both of you. He needs closure, so please visit him as soon as you are able. Alright, looks like we're not going to Victory Road just yet, because we've got um, got someone to meet at um, Palmetto Resort. Over on the top floor. Um, wait. Um, aren't I supposed to be able to go here? Yeah, when you stay there to go to the top floor, please. I found a TM while I was cleaning the floors that I've used for it, but I'm sure you'll be able to use it. TM15, what's that? That sounds pretty cool. Um, Hyper Beam, nice. Hey there. Well, up to Fusion Co now that Michael's gone, I don't know. Hmm, me neither. I'm guessing someone's waiting for us in here. Oh, you're kidding me? It's a Pikachu and a scarf. Michael gave you the key then? I guess he was reliable after all. I've been thinking a lot about what I've been doing in my life, chasing you around for revenge. What's the point? Let's battle one more time just for closure, okay? Yeah, I get to battle this dude again. I'm happy. I'm a happy chappy. That's pretty awesome. Come on. Pikachu, low 50. Go twist. Let's use a rock climb. Yeah, I'm pretty happy I get to battle this Pikachu again. I liked, I liked this guy. You know, he's not the great battle in the world, but yeah, I like him. There we go. I think I know what I need to do. I want to settle down with a trainer and battle for good instead of evil. I don't care if you say yes or no, you're going to be my trainer. You kidding me? Awesome. Let's just go check out our new Pikachu. Oh my god, he's still got the scarf. He's still got the scarf. Summary. Um, vault tackle, double edge, light screen, zap cannon. Um, 
pretty, you know, he's pretty fast, but apart from that, not much else. Um, that's pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome, actually. We got ourselves a Pikachu. We're not going to use him, but yeah, we got him. So there's that. Um, and now we can head back to Victory Road. Probably have to go through all that rubbish about the forest again, but oh well. I'm back to town. Yeah, we've got to do all this again. Oh. Man, that seems pointless. Unless we can just fly like a normal place. Oh cool, we can fly here, nice. Well that just made my job easier. Pikachu was under a constant struggle for revenge, but he seems to be at peace with you. I don't feel like I belong in Chunan anymore. Regina filed for divorce and there's nothing but bad memories. I'm going to Sunrise region for now. Oh, I forgot to tell you, I ended up releasing Dialga, Palkia, Garatina. It felt like the right thing to do. Pidgeot, use fly. Okay, so uh, Garatina, Palkia and uh, Dialga have all been released, it seems. It's pretty cool. Can you handle Victory Road? I'm sure I can manage. No worries. Um, let's use... Let's use Leaf Blade, why not? Didn't do nearly as much stuff like I would. There we go. Did just enough for a 3-hit KO. Polyrath. This will do more. 1-hit KO. Lovely stuff. And a Breloom will switch into Gift. Because why not? I might get full 54 off of this. That's not quite, quite nice. There we go. Let me go ahead and use a Repel. Um, there we go. I could really do with a match repel right now, guys. I'm gonna throw that one out there. Leaf Blade got a nice crit there. Low 52 for Twist. Rhyperia. This guy's got a pretty cool team. Yeah, it's, uh, I approve of his team. It's a pretty nice team. I'm not lost, I'm exploring. All good for you, buddy. I'm bots on your face. Ha! <laughs> he thought that would hurt me. The trio. Well, here's a Leaf Blade for you. Thanks for playing. Wait, is this Victory Road? Am I in Victory Road right now? I feel like I might be in Victory Road. I don't know how long this is. I think this might be Victory Road right here, guys. Wow, I didn't even realise, but we are in Victory Road, it seems. Come on, I need a, need a crit here. Give me a crit. Didn't give me a crit. Okay, we'll switch into Cheeks then. Slam. Well, I've got an Earthquake, so I win. No. What? Kidding me? How did that kill you? I feel cheated. Only thing left to do is bow your head and keep climbing. Indeed. Yeah, we're in Victory Road. I didn't even realise, but this is indeed Victory Road. Let's see if we can defeat this thing in seven minutes and make it a twenty-minute episode. Um, what's down here? I'm suave and a great battler. No, that's good to know, buddy. Ah, uh, that's not a good matchup at all. Um, let's bring in Oreo. Why not? There we go. Okay, what's up here? Need to use another repel. Got another dude. Ah, uh, why do? Why does everything need Earthquake to die? What's the annoying thing in the world? Earthquake. Eek. Ran to Greek. Um, of three. Nice. Shell gone. Let's bring in ice. Oh, not ice. I can call him gift ice. I don't know why. Um, I guess because it's ice type and it was ice beam. Like, gift is like the ultimate dragon slayer. I love it. I totally should have called a uh, gift Dovakin. Just gonna throw that one out there right now. Okay. Of course I'm not lost. Blah blah blah. I think you're lost. And you're dead. Now you're lost with that Pokemon. Okay, what's up here? Fighting type, we'll switch into Notch then. There we go. Let's take care of this dude. I hope we don't get a um, rival battle straight after Victory Road. I hate when games do that. It's literally the most annoying thing ever. Like, games just seem to love to stick a rival at the end of Victory Road just to, you know, hey, you got through Victory Road, congrats. Now here's a chance to get owned by your face. I uh, need a repel. Okay. Do we go up here now? Do you know the way to the top? Well, I hope I do. I probably don't, but I hope I do. 
Ah, there it is. A canine. Let's switch into... Switch into Cheeks for this one. Use an Earthquake. I think it's going to be faster than us. Oh, it wasn't. Nice. Awesome. Are we near the top yet? I guess not. This dude's meditating. Well, we're going to use Fly and uh, you can keep meditating all you want. Notch level 56. Oh, Notch is crazy OP now, right? It's awesome. Okay, let's go up here. Is this the end? Please be the end. I hate victory roads. They're always too long. Hey, we made it to the end. Ah, oh, path of victory, guys. We made it. Repels effect wore off. That's a shame. Core badge detected. You may proceed. Man, oh man, we're finally at... Oh my god, we're at the Elite Four. This is awesome. I really like this. Um, let's switch into Anubis as well. Twist and Anubis. Do us proud. Fighting type supreme. Electric types are supreme. Well, let's see. Polyrath and Magnazone. Let's go for a Leaf Blade. And let's go for a... Well, let's go for an Earthquake. Why not? There we go. And there we go. I guess my Pokemon are supreme and not either electric or fighting types. Clover badge detected, you may proceed. And that's the final badge. We're here at the Elite Four, guys. Tunod League, the final challenge for trainers. Tunod League, the final challenge for trainers. No way! We made it, guys. We did Victory Road. And I'm going to call it an episode here because next episode, we take on the Elite Four. Hey, it's a collab. My boyfriend is challenging the Elite Four. I want to support him, but only challenges are allowed inside. If it makes you feel less nervous, do you want to hug me for your challenge? Yes, I do. I feel a warm glow of confidence kindle within. Awesome. Once you enter that door, you'll be coming out as a champion or defeated. I'm dreadfully nervous. Well, you should be, buddy. Um, I'm going to buy a bunch of stuff here. Um, I'm going to buy so many high potions, you won't believe. So let's buy 30. Um, let's buy some revives. Let's buy 20 revives. And we'll buy some full heals. Let's buy... Let's buy 15 full heals. Um, and a few full restores. Let's buy 13 full restores. There we go. So we're all set up for the Elite Four, it seems. Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode where we conquered Victory Road. Next episode, we are heading straight to Elite Four and we are going to own face. So I'm very excited. But guys, that is going to be it for this episode. Episode 21 of Pokemon Glazed. Next episode, we'll be taking the first two members of the Elite Four. The episode after that, we'll be taking on the final two members. And the episode after that, we will take on the champion. All going to plan. Thanks guys for watching. My name's Liam, and I'll catch you all next time, Pokemon Glazed. Later, guys.